This is Artifacts from Mars. Ah, uh, you better get the kids out of the room. I'm a little angry. Uh, this concerns a Birmingham, Alabama cop who remembered the uh, lessons of the Michael Brown incident where Michael Brown was an unarmed motorist who got shot by Darren Wilson and Ferguson. Of course, they burned the city to the ground. Uh, a bunch of hoods did. Now, so in Birmingham, Alabama, a plain clothes cop went and stopped uh, someone who was uh, using all four lanes or whatever. And here's a picture of the uh, accused slime, Gennard Cunningham. Charged with attempted murder after he allegedly pistol whipped a Birmingham, Alabama cop with an officer's own gun Friday. That's the accused slime right there. The cop doesn't want to be named, and they blacked out his face. But apparently, he had his head bashed in and he was pistol whipped. Now, This is beyond, this, this whole thing has gotten, gotten out of hand. The cop, cops can't even defend themselves anymore. And if they don't, they wind up getting beaten up by some slime ball like this. Now, what the fuck is wrong here? I'll tell you what's wrong. You know, Darren Wilson received a trial by media. I've said before, the media has gotten so powerful in this country that they're actually conducting trials. This is outrageous. The slime... You see, this cop stopped the slime, and then slime got out, and... The cop wanted to do the politically correct thing and not draw his gun. And this is what he got. He got his head bashed in. And to make matters worse, there are criminals on uh, social media like Al Com Birmingham after 813 me or that is, Pistol pimped his face and um children now. Um children now. In other words, the criminals are laughing about this on social media and they're not even uh, hauled in the, you know, they're not even arrested. Uh, if you're not infuriated by this, then I don't know what's wrong with it. This cop, first of all, this cop should have drawn his gun and said, All right, hands on head, you're staying right there until I get back up. That's what should have happened. He had already called for backup. Uh, this thing's gotten out of control. I mean, I, uh, am not a big lover of cops myself, but, on the other hand, I have to side with the cops on this one. This is beyond, this is beyond ho horrific, alright? I can't tolerate this. I hope this hood spends the rest of his life in jail. He is a hood. He is a criminal. If he gets convicted, of course. 
alleged criminal. And these criminals who are laughing about this on social media, I don't know why cops aren't going and knocking on their doors and saying, hey, what's up with this? This is not free speech. Uh, they're threatening people, as far as I'm concerned, and at the very least, they should have a sudden handcuff slapped on them and be taken to uh, uh, jail awaiting trial. Not free speech when you're threatening people and laughing about a crime. That's not that's not free speech. Right. Folks, uh you really need to uh do some bitching about this because I don't know what to bitch about other than we gotta stand up for the cops when they're in the right. And this cop was in the right. I'd love nothing more than to see this hood convicted and sent to prison for a long, long time. That's about that. Uh, this is a criminal. Um, we've got to uh, wake the hell up, people. That's all I can say. Wake the hell up. They're letting these uh, criminals get out of hand and something needs to be done about it. This is our effects, Mars. Thanks for watching.